Something in your eyes makes me want to lose myself. Makes me want to lose myself. When I first met Caroline, um, in your arms. And you just I just knew you felt it. And just certain things felt that you've never felt before. Just and call them butterflies and whatever, just things that are undescribable. It's one of those where I really, I really do feel loved. Most people, you know, they question it. I don't question it at all. And I don't ever question whether, you know, whether we'll last or not. seen her happy with anybody else like I've seen her with Joe. Um, he brings out the best in her and their relationship together is one that's probably hard to find. <laughs> what they have is very special. Caroline's like, I, I don't know, it's Caroline's definitely like, you know, a person that when you first see her you just, you smile, you know, and I think for my brother like, uh, it's always something great to come home to, you know, when you're if you're having a bad day, he's a police officer, so if it's a bad day, just being able to see that smile and just like, you just fall in love again, you know, so uh, I think for my brother, I think Caroline's more than perfect for him. It feels like a a very loving, passionate person and she became a granddaughter almost the moment I met her because of the way she treated me. She uh, worked with my papa. Uh, you could just tell she, when she was around papa, papa's eyes just lit up. He, uh, she was always there to help. Got his hair. Anything she could do, she'd do it. And he loved her to death. kind of set them up she um, I'm a nail tech and I do I've done her nails and toes for a while and so I had the opportunity to get to know her first just talking with Caroline and everything I knew there was something special there with her my favorite part was being able to be there with Caroline um, and watching her get dressed and how calm she was she she was not nervous even 20 minutes before she was to walk down the aisle, she was literally sitting in a chair in her wedding dress playing with one of the flower girls. Um, I knew at that point she didn't, the wedding wasn't about her, it was about her marrying the man that she loves, my son. Joe sent a lot of years, him and his brother had been my world. I mean, that's the most important thing and now the three of them are the most important thing in my life. Feels like I'm all the way back. <laughs> I really knew Joe was the one from the minute she met him um, and I know for a fact that he adores her and so that means more to me than anything. The one word I think of when I think of them is adoration. I mean, they they truly, it's like the world stops when one of them walks in the room. It's just, it radiates.
thought the wedding was just perfect. Just perfect expression of who Caroline and Joe are. That was really my goal, just to make it specifically Joe and Caroline. I just wanted to make it really personal. I done the archway and then done cupcake stands and said, welcome to Joe and Caroline's wedding, our wedding. And I done that. I, I done quite a few little odds and ends. Such a beautiful, amazing woman, and you most definitely deserve a wonderful husband. So that's why I'm not going to get any sleep until I figure out what the heck happened here. <laughs> Joe, I know from the bottom of my heart that you are head over cowboy boots for Caroline. I see the way that you look at her and the way she takes your breath away when she opens her mouth to sing. She is an angel. She deserves to be treated like one. She's heaven sent and the epitome of a perfect wife. But with that being said, as a wife, Caroline will always have your clothes smelling of the highest potency fabric soap and dryer sheets. She will always be clean and your dogs will always be school rotten. She will never let anything scented run low. You will always have a, a candle burning in your house and most importantly, she will love you with every cell in her body because that is what angels do. 